Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today I'm going to be reviewing Mr. Monopoly. So let's get started. So if you guys don't know who Mr. Monopoly is, or the board game Monopoly, I don't know where you've been for the probably last 50, 60 years. Mr. Monopoly is uh, a very iconic board game character, and this is what he looks like in the actual... Um, game there on this side here. Now they gave him the more colored version because I'm pretty sure in the newer stuff He actually is more colored like that. Now this is from Monopoly and if I'm not mistaken, is not Monopoly a Hasbro game? It is, which is weird because Hasbro is like another toy company with Funko. So Monopoly, it says right down here guys um, Trademark of Hasbro for its property a training game and its game equipment. So Hasbro is the licensor to Mr. or to Monopoly and everything. So I don't know how they somehow got the license to Mr. Monopoly, but here he is here guys. This is an amazing character. I love this thing so much. Do you guys hear Bailey barking? One second. Sorry about that guys, we're back now. But so Mr. Monopoly is such a cool character just because there's so much going on with this. I also like how they did the background of it on the side here, how you can see the money down the sides with like the 20s, the 10s, the 50s, the 100s, the 500s. I just think it looks really nice like that. And this one was sent to me in the fan mail. Um, I can't remember who sent it, but if you did, thank you so much. They also sent Crota and um, Jeffrey the Giraffe, and that was such an awesome thing for you to send, so thank you so much for that. But I wanna get into this one, guys. This was a Walmart exclusive. Then there was also another piece like this one that was Mr. Monopoly, and he was supposed to look like the game pieces, how they're all completely silver, and that was exclusive to the 12 Days of Funko, and that was a really cool character. But here he is here, guys, you can see him. Such a nice character. I love the way the Mr. Monopoly looks. Now let me see if I can zoom in on that a little bit better so you guys can see that I'll get out of the way. Um, I think this character, honestly, is one of my favorite ones that I have in the collection right now. Just because it's so different, and I just love the way it looks as well. The giant mustache, you guys can also see his hair on the sides there. Bald head on the back there. But also the hair on the sides again. And then he's also got the entire body. I like the way he's got his hand out like that too. I think that looks pretty cool. But Mr. Monopoly, overall, such a nice character. I think he goes really well in the Funko like Funko's like line or whatever of pop. I just, what I mean is I think it looks good as a pop character, guys. I don't think it looks weird. I think it looks pretty much just like he would in the actual, you know, board game. So there he is there, guys, on the side. Now, other ones that I was thinking that they could make is like um, some Candyland characters or the Operation guy. Um, I can't think of any games. Like Games are kind of like, kind of like skipping my head right now. Like there's some that are like some weird ones from Yahtzee. If you guys play the Yahtzee dice game on the, on the iOS and Android, everything, they've got like little dice characters with like little arms and stuff like that. That's not big, but I mean, it could be something. Um, I can't think of anything. If you guys can think of any board game characters that you would want to see, put it in the comment section below. Because this is board games number one, so it's not like they have anything else kind of like lined up maybe or anything like that, but I would want to see some more board games characters. I think this one's just such a cool one. I love the bow tie. I love everything about it. Um, it just looks so neat and different and everything like that. And now that they're doing board games, I think this is a good addition to the line. Um, but anyways, guys, let me show you some close-ups and a quick clip of Mr. Monopoly now. Wait, I can't show you a clip. He's a board game. Whatever. I'll find something. You know what I mean. Monopoly's been good to me. Very, very good. Guys, this has been another episode of Top Pops. Before we go, I also thought of another one. Hungry Hungry Hippos would be a cool one. But anyways, guys, I just thought of that one. Maybe they could have like all four of them in a four pack or something like that because there's the four different sides. Or, I don't know, something cool with that. Scrabble, there really isn't anything. Like a lot of board games don't have characters like Mr. Monopoly. But I think one that would be pretty cool is Hungry Hungry Hippos. But anyways, guys, this has been another episode of Top Pops. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you guys want me to review any other ones, let me give you some uh, Crota. Holographic Kylo Ren. I didn't want to do that one today because I don't really have time to go down and do the whole glow in the dark thing that takes a while. Um, but maybe maybe in a few days we'll do the Kylo Ren one. I don't know. Uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, this has been another episode of Top Pops. Popsters, thanks for watching. I think I've had